Hey guys, California Antkeeper here and with another episode. Today we're going to be moving another colony that needs a bigger home. Today I got a special guest for you guys, my daughter, the little Antkeeper, since this is officially her colony. Hi, I'm the little Antkeeper. Today we're going to move Campanatus Regulus. We're going to be moving them from the Tar Heel Ants Fortress into the Tar Heel Ants Nucleus Nest. This colony has been needing to move into a bigger nest for a long time. I'm going to get ready for them to move into the nucleus by adding some nectar into the outworld and a handful of fruit flies. They haven't had nectar for a long time, so they should move in. Now we're ready to move the Campanatus into the new nest. Make sure you look at the color before and after they move into the nest because they will change color during the move. These ants are really good at escaping, so we got to connect the tube fast. Every time we feed these guys, we get at least one or two escapes, and we have to put them back in. This is also a desert species, so we took the heat off the old nest, and we ran a heat cable under the new one. As soon as we connected it, they ran up the tube. Luckily, we didn't have any escapes as I was connecting it. And they're already making their way to the new nest. The nucleus is a double-sided nest, so I shined light on the back, so that way they would move to the front where we could see them. Campanatus fragilis absolutely hate light. Tons of curious workers are already pouring up the tube. They're absolutely too scared to go into the new nest. But they kept pouring up the tube and eventually they worked up the courage to enter the nest. For the first few minutes, these yellow workers seemed only interested in the flies. They continue to explore their new outworld. So far, it's going smoother than I thought it would, but they still haven't found the entrance to their new nest. More and more Campanatus fragilis are pouring into the nest every second. This species of ant is crazy fast and very unpredictable. They dart in random directions. These thirsty girls are finally found the nectar. I can see the color changing in these workers immediately. And it looks like the first worker is about to enter the nest. Oh, never mind. When are these girls going to find the nest? It took a while for them to find the actual nest portion, but once they did, they started all pouring in. There's the first worker now. Exploring giant nest, the second one. And they're just roaming through it crazy. I really think they like their new nest. More and more workers are pouring in, but they're doing more hunting for flies than anything. And they're taking the flies back to the old nest still. So it doesn't look like they're showing any signs of moving into the new nest. Now you can really tell that they're changing colors. A lot more workers are starting to go through the nest portion. So hopefully they bring the sign back to the queen. It's time to move soon. And the original fortress nest is still packed. So it doesn't even look like any ants left at all. This move is way overdue. Oh no, they're escaping from some. I think they're getting out from that plug on the side of the nest. Dad, they're everywhere. So I tightened up where they were getting out of and sucked up the escaped ones with the aspirator. And then I threw the container into the new outworld. That's definitely where they're escaping. I think it's time to call it a night and we'll check back tomorrow. It's the next day and all the broods moved in. But I don't see the queen in the new nest. It's pretty cold in my garage right now, so that's why there's so much condensation on the glass. All right, let's check the old nest. All right, back in the old nest, there's still a little bit of brood. You can definitely see the color difference. All of the workers are a little red now. There's a lot of majors in the old nest as well. I think I see her in the left corner. Oh yeah, there she is. At least we didn't miss her move. Okay, she's finally starting to move. There she's coming out. Is she going to move? Not yet. I put a little water in the nest to encourage her to move, but it didn't work. Finally, there she goes. 
Yeah, with a little help from an air compressor. You put the air compressor in there, really? Yeah, but it worked, and now all her workers are pushing her through the tube, and she looks like she doesn't want to go, but they're talking her into it. Yay, she's finally in the new nest. And she's going straight for the nest entrance. She went in, she went in, yay! All right, that's pretty much the end of the move. The queen was the last thing to go in. These guys are getting comfy in their new home. And I hope you guys enjoyed our video. Hope you guys enjoyed it, me having Little Ant Keeper in a video. And thank you guys for all your support. I'll see you guys next time.